and welcome back to the welcome back to the channel everybody as you can see we have a beautiful day i'm not in my jacket anymore it's excellent um, we're going to be switching over the implements on the tractor today so that's the front end loader the backhoe and we're switching off the snowblower and the back blade or box blade i guess uh, one of my viewers suggested that i should put rubber um, dampeners on the stirrups for the snowblower so that's what i'm going to do first so here are the stirrups for the snowblower and as you can see i've got this rubber mat and what i'm going to do is cut some pieces off and then it'll sit in there so that the snowblower k-connect can sit in them without being metal on metal touching all right so now you can see that i have the rubber in there, it just sits in there nice, and that'll be a nice dampener. All right, so there it is, all ready for cleaning. And I'll also be uh, rust checking it, priming some spots, painting it, and then putting it away in the shed. It's also high enough that I can use my pallet forks to get underneath it to lift it up. So I'm very happy with that. Let's move on to the next one. All right, now it's time to move the front end loader. So let's go ahead and do that now. Right, so now that it's in place, what I did through the off season was, let me just show you. When I took it off the loader, I angled in the uprights so that I didn't have any of the shocks on the hydraulic rams showing or any of the chrome parts. Uh, so it's all kept inside. So what I'm gonna have to do first is hook up my hydraulic hoses and then I'll start the machine. I'll angle these back so they're in the correct spot so I can hook it up into the stirrups here.
alert is on. That's it guys, it's now officially switched over to summer work mode. Lots of projects to, to do. So thanks very much for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.